by and large, they're, they're amongst America's greatest. As a veteran himself, Republican Congressman Don Bacon was upset to see pictures of National Guard soldiers resting in a parking garage. I think we could do better. To me, it was a callous decision, especially to do it the day after the inaugural. Friday, Democrat Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer said his office would make sure soldiers are allowed to take breaks inside the Capitol. Every member of the Guard was found proper accommodations inside. And as of this morning, everyone was accounted for and taken care of. Our representatives are just uh, trying to support us as best they can. Um, I'm sure whatever they saw on the news concerned them and they're, they're rallying to our defense. Nebraska National Guardsmen have been staying in hotels overnight and they say they were not forced to take breaks in the parking garage. We don't have any members of the Nebraska National Guard serving in D.C. who were um, asked or told to move out of one area and move to another. Sergeant Jacob Anderberry says he and other guardsmen actually enjoyed the setup in the parking garage. It's really nice having room to put all your stuff and lay all your stuff out, uh, you know, and being a block, block and a half away from where you're, uh, you know, where you're working. Officials are also asking up to 7,000 National Guardsmen to voluntarily stay in Washington, D.C. through mid-March. Federal agencies are hearing of possible protests planned. Reporting in Omaha, Quinesia Fraser, KETV News Watch 7.